Okay, welcome to uh, update one of my Franken-Suron twin motor build. So I've just installed the motor bracket, uh, got it yesterday, and it fits really well. I did have to sand these faces a little because I got the distance between these a little off, but apart from that, it looks really good. So the motor is a Plettenberg Nova 15. And this is basically where it's going to sort of sit. Um, the cooling fins will extend past this ring just a little bit, but it looks like I've got that quite uh, quite nicely designed there. Um, this motor plate will take all the uh, all the force from the chains, all the torque. So it basically is pushed directly in that direction. The sprocket will be aligned directly with this plate. So there'll be no bending or twisting of this plate here. Uh, these are M10 bolts. I had to sleeve these, these holes. These are, uh, I think, 916 by 20 <coughs> uh, threaded holes. Uh, there's left-hand thread and right-hand thread. So I sleeve them, and then the sleeves have a 10 millimeter bore for these bolts. So that worked out pretty well. Uh, I had to grind away just these foot pegs here to clear these bolts. And I had to remove the kickstand, obviously. But this is the other side. This is the insulation on the other side. So you can see, yeah, just a little bit of grinding had to be done there. But I'm pretty happy with it. It looks really nice. And uh, the profile, if you look from the side, the profile is quite flat along here. So there's nothing sticking out to get hit on. So, yeah. Uh, next step will be installing the motor. I'm just waiting for Plattenberg to build the motor. Uh, it'll be a little, it'll probably be another two months before I see that. I am going to get the sprockets here in the next five days. Um, so I'll get the sprocket, oh, the chain at least. So I'll get the sprockets machined up and we'll get that part of the transmission installed. So I'm using a 219 go kart chain. Um, I think. That's much better than a belt drive for this situation. It's going to have more torque capability. So yeah, that's what it looks like. It should be pretty cool. Okay, catch you next time.